Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Sun and Moon, and in this episode, now that we have the Water Yum Z, I guess it's time to take down the Sudowoodo and... What the... That is the... I don't think it was the Sudowoodo making that noise, and I guess they just run away, and the strange trees did not attack, but went running toward the Battle Royale Dome. Okay then, and hey, what's up? Ha <laughs> ha! The Sudowoodo were off like a flash once they were reminded of that Z power. Thanks. Now everyone can use the road again! Here's a sudden return! Uh, thanks, bro, and- oh, Mystic Water. Why don't you just use a Mystic Water on the- <laughs> Whatever, and- I wonder if maybe those pseudo would have ran off to the Battle Royale Don't we get stronger? I don't know, maybe. Why don't you ask him? You know about the Battle Royale Dome, right? That's the place where you do Battle Royales! Oh, you could have fooled me. Also, in between episodes, guys, I decided to do a little bit of nicknaming. Basically, this Pokemon's insane! I didn't realize its ability till now, but apparently, once this thing gets to level 20, just like Magikarp, it will turn into, oh, well, basically the same wishy-washy, but it'll be able to activate its schooling ability. So yeah, that's kind of insane. Once we get it to level 20, I think this guy might be able to do a ton of damage. Also, I apparently got a Jolly Nature, which isn't very good, because... Pretty sure like speeds is my worst stat, but anyways, I also decided to nickname Lemon. I don't know why I named it that. Just, just kind of did. That, that's its name from now on. Also, I didn't name Magnemite, but yeah, everyone else is doing pretty well. I decided to level up a tiny bit just so we don't have an as embarrassing of a battle as the last episode. But yeah, moving onward, I guess up next is Route Six. Oh, I thought it was Route Seven for some reason, and. It doesn't seem like there's a whole lot going on over here. There's a trainer right over there from the looks of it, but I don't know if I really want to battle him right now. So I guess we'll just continue onward in crud. What Pokemon is out in front? I might actually use Lemon for a little bit here. I didn't think Lemon was actually going to be that strong, but I'm actually glad I'm like still using her. She's pretty darn powerful and whoa. What's up? <laughs> you there, trainer? You come to my... Oh, she actually is Southern in. Over here. Uh, hi there. Yo, yo, yo! Don't go turning your backside on us! And you! You're that Noma Skull trainer for Melee Melee! Yo! <laughs> uh, what's up? And these scoundrels are Pokemon thieves. And you're familiar in terms with them. Uh. It's not like that. I don't know these dweebs and. Yo, for real? I am Hapu. So, Hapu? Life in the big city sure is something else. Pokemon thieves roam around brazenly. Hmm. I'll leave that one to you. We're not thieves, yo. It's a legitimate business. <laughs> okay, and we got straight mess up in Melee Melee. Got exiled to Akala. We ain't going out like that. Well, how are you going out? I hope you have enough layers, because it's starting to get kind of cool. Anywho, enough of my uh, <laughs> near useless banter. Let the battle begin. All right, Team Skull Grunt B. Do you have anything new? Nope, just the, just the same drowsy. All right, in the Safari Ball. You know what, man? Honestly, I had high expectations for. Honestly, this guy's like a trainer, right? Should he like spend time and get other Pokemon? Maybe he's doing a speed run challenge. He's trying to beat the game really quickly with the drowsy. I don't know why you'd ever do that. Whatever. Thanks to the free XP, dude. And bone dry. Yeah. I guess, I guess you are, because you lost? That doesn't make much sense, and with all these losses, we're gonna anger our bosses. Their tears taste like salt, yo. <laughs> it's all your fault, yo. <laughs> Floon? Me? Mud scale. Shall we stomp these <laughs> scoundrels? Oh gosh, that would hurt. Maybe you missed a clean up afterward. I'm willing if you are. Oh gosh, time to t for us to break out, yo. Gotta tell y'all, peace out, yo! <laughs> I'm not gonna keep telling you this. Except, when I keep telling you this, you better listen to what my homie says and drill it into that thick skull of yours. Seriously, you better not forget, numbskull. Yeah, yeah, get out of here, nerds, and you'll be fine getting home. Floon. Alright, see you later, uh, Trifloon, <laughs> I guess, and glad to see that one will be getting home on her own. I've got to thank you for that. Give me your name, trainer. Johnny, huh? That's a fine name. I like the oh, <laughs> uh, like the way you handled yourself in battle. Uh, thank you. Mudsat, wait, Mudsdale. Oh, okay, Mudsdale and I are always wandering around Alola, 
trying to achieve our goals, so perhaps we'll meet again someday. I'm indebted to you for your aid, after all. It wasn't that big a deal, it's kind of like my role in life to beat up that grunt and, ah yes, you might want to try your hand at the battle royale or two. Muzdale and I were thinking suited to you. Get yeah, how strong you are. Alright, I'll check it out, I suppose, and that's an interesting color scheme for Pokemon. I don't think, like, brown and orange is really a common thing. Can we actually go this way? Oh, we can. There's trainers. Should I battle her? I don't even know who I have. Uh, sure, why not? Lemon can easily beat her, and I think you need to change your Pokemon, or train my Pokemon. I mean, what do you think I'm about to do? This is how I train Miss Brittany. She looks like a Brittany. I don't know why. And, oh, crud, Cubone. Uh, well, we do have Wishy-Washy, but at the same time, wishy washy is kind of frail, so I don't know how I'm going to beat this Pokemon, considering its defenses are usually pretty darn high, but I could go for the Pluck again, because I have the Sharp Beak. This should do pretty, oh wow, really respectable damage. Awesome, so, that's great. Uh, that's not so great, though. Crud, how am I going to beat, hmm, let's think about this. I should, yeah. Found enough. Okay, good. Now that's taken care of! Uh, thanks for the level 21. I appreciate it. And wow, our attack set is like, I think our attack set's even higher than, oh my gosh, it wants to learn Roost. Okay, this Pokemon just keeps getting better and better. I understand it's like not the most exciting typing in the world, but holy crud, man. Getting Roost this early in the game, gosh, and how wonderful. I can smell the sarcasm from here. I don't know how you smell. What does sarcasm even smell like? I don't know. Anyways, after that uh, very minor distraction, let's head to the next town over to this Battle Royale dome everyone keeps talking about. And, hey, this place looks pretty cool. There's a volcano behind it and everything. And there's even a Machamp and a Hariyama balloon. And there's even a Machamp. How about that? <laughs> it's kind of strange, but in a good way, I guess. Just my champs all around, and yo, what up, dude? The Battle Royale. It's an imitation we trainers have devised. Battle on- wait, imitate, yeah. Based on battles that are the four guardians of our islands like to take part in, decide who's the strongest of them all. Really? They have that competition? That sounds kind of interesting. What you up to? There are Pokemon that love to eat this so-called garbage that humans throw away. It really proves that a thing's value depends on where you stand, doesn't it? Nah, he's talking about garbage or a muck? Can't really tell, but yeah, that's kind of interesting if you think about it, and... Oh, snap, it's Gladian! <laughs> Why do I do this? Every time something brings me down, I end up coming right back here again. Come on, no. Let's go bury our sorrow in the crowd. Oh. Alright then, well hey, at least, you know, you recognize that. That's a positive, right? Mm. Looking good! Uh, thank you? Uh, what's up, Machamp? <laughs> Champ. Same. Wait, is that guy your brother, bro? Um, might not ever be royalty. But you might as least feel like you are if you take on the Battle Royale. Not the Battle Royale Dome. Directly in front of me. Everyone's playing Battle Royale Dome. You could just say the Dome. Abbreviate it. I get what you mean, and... Whoa, this music, not bad. I'm digging it. Yo, I'm ready. Let's start the Battle Royale, man. And, uh... That's an interesting... Oh, they're boxing gloves, and... Glad you could make it! Oh. My. Is that who I think it is? I'm here today, yeah! To spread the word! Oh, yeah! About Battle Royale! They call me... The Master Royal! Woo! Professor? The Master Royal! I'm here to teach you, oh yeah, about the battle format passed down in for a load of generations, the Battle Royale. But Royal, what's the Battle Royale, you might ask? Four trainers, four trainers, yeah! Each pick three Pokemon, yeah! For one big Pokemon battle, oh yeah! When one trainer's team can't battle anymore, yeah! The Battle Royale ends. Whichever trainer has taken the most Pokemon, yeah! Has the most Pokemon left, will emerge the winner. Woo! Professor, you, you probably should put a shirt on. Just throwing that out there and first, give it a shot! Pick your Pokemon and let's do this! Dude, it's the Masked Royal! I wanna battle, I wanna battle! I mean, you can, it takes four and- You there! 
Come join in the fun! He'll be in the mix too, yeah! And now we'll have our four- Not sure I feel about that terminology. Anyways, just to go for the new experiences, adventure! It's all yours if you want it! It's time for Battle Royale! Ready, fight! Wait, crap, I have lemon out front. Uh, That could be- Oh, crud, the battle's starting already. I sure hope he healed up my Pokemon and... That's an interesting, like, battle theme, huh? We're in the Battle Royale Dome! The arena for Battle Royales! The dome is packed and filled with excitement! I'm trying to be the announcer from Pokemon Stadium, and now, here come the contenders! Dang, I hope I come out of the Tyranitar- Oh, snap, I did, dude. In the green corner, let's see it, Lemon! <laughs> Why'd I name my Pokemon Lemon? <laughs> I don't know why, but... Okay, he sent out a- oh, cruddy as a rock rough. Yeah, it's totally not the professor. And, oh, look at his stance and everything, crud, and Gladian sending out type null. Okay, that's to be expected, but... Crud. Okay, so if it's the first one to get a knockout, who should I go for? I guess I have to go for how, right? Okay. Ah, oh, crud, I didn't get full healed. Oh, uh, this is bad. I didn't even know this was happening. All right, so potentially, what would do more damage? I'm pretty sure the pluck on Dartrix would do the max amount of damage, because, yeah, there's no reason to go for Type Null, right? Oh, crud, I hope I can do this, and... Wow, someone knows how to play free for all is Professor. <laughs> Going for the Protect, I see, and let's try the Peck. We do have really high attack stat. Oh, man, so close. Let's go for Tackle on. Wait. Oh, my gosh, you just barely... Okay, next turn, I think I am the fastest. As long as Rock Ruff doesn't, like, outspeed me... I think it might, though. Crud, if he goes for Dartrix, I lose. <laughs> Crud, this is this is exciting because it's not about who does the most damage. It's okay. I am faster. Awesome. I think I won. Yeah, definitely. Awesome. So, so, sorry, how I, I kind of pick on you a lot. And wait, it's not over. What? Are there multiple KO? I'm. So, oh no, that's it. The dump. Okay, so I guess the round isn't over once I get the KO. It keeps going on. Dang, that's awesome. I want to play this online now. Need friends though, and so what do you think? It's easy to have fun time with a battle royale. Woo! You even had a better shot of beating the real tough opponents this way, yeah! You were on fire during that battle. Hope you bring that fire you burn up my trial. Wait, what the? Oh. Wait, is this the grass trial leader? Name's Kiawe, the fire cat. Oh, I guess he's fire. Who would have thought? You can get to Whale Up Volcano Park from Route 7. I'll be waiting on the peak. If you plan to see your island challenge to the end, climb to the top with your strongest team. All right, well that was convenient and... So, Johnny, how, how are your trials going? I hope you and your Pokemon are working hard and having a blast. Ooh! But Mr. Master Royal, how'd you know we're doing our trials right now? Oh, I get it, because of our amulets. <laughs> well, I'm having a blast. Why are you here? Uh, why would you even want to do a battle royale? I was talking to Gladian. Oh, here comes the pose. Ooh, there it is. Because Null and I have to make it on our own. And I don't ever want to forget that. Okay. What's that have to do with battle royale? And wow, you're just a ray of sunshine, huh? I think you have a lot more fun if you just let yourself have a good time with everyone else. We can do a lot more together, too. Eh, well, I don't know what his deal is, but I thought the battle was just plain fun. Yeah, because you almost won, and that's why I like doing battle royales. My Pokemon seem to like them, too. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I have to kind of test it out in, like, you know, action, though. We didn't really get a real peek at that, and I wonder where the... Is the Mass Royal gone? He is! Crud, man! I want to I wanna get his autograph! Not really, but... That was at least a... Cool diversion, at least. I guess they wanted you to like battle type null again, so they're like, you know, let's do it that way. And yo, what up? And you got your hands on a fishing rod for the first time. Can't wait to go shore and search for Pokemon. I, I probably should do that, but I already have like wishy washy. And for those who are cute crap, that is not where I wanted to go, but yeah, that's what the trainer passport looks like. But uh, <laughs> for those who are wondering, I for the life of me could not think of a nickname for wishy washy, so when in doubt, I just go for the like the Japanese name, which is Yowashi. I think it sounds okay for the time being, but if you have a- Oh, now there's a cell over there, but if you have a cooler sounding one, eh, I'm down to hear it, but yeah, I don't know if there's really too much to do in this, like, town. It seems 
kind of on the smaller side. I kind of want to check it out though. And also, yeah, I finally figured out how to bind our like Pokemon to this thing. You just have to touch it on the bottom screen. I don't know why that took me so long. And what type of trainer is this? I think we've seen her yet. The Oricorio are so cute as they pluck at the flowers to get their nectar. Own battle. The move pluck will actually let Pokemon eat berries. Yeah, 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 I know that. Is it oh yeah, this is a Photoshop. Or not a Photoshop. A photo spot. Is there Oreocorio here? No, it doesn't look like there's any Pokemon actually. Or maybe they're just so tiny I don't see them. Huh. Wait, I hear something. Where is it? Is it up there? Oh it is! There's a butterfree! Oh snap. Stand still. That was okay, I guess. I wanna say it's beautiful, Rotom, and eh, we can look at him later. I think I'm actually no. We're good. Oh, okay, yeah. I keep thinking he's like, you want to check out your photos. That's not what he's saying, but yeah, that's a pretty cool spot. I wonder if you get something if you go to all of those. And is this just a shop for beans? Yeah, I think it is. So all in all, this town's okay, but not something super memorable, I guess. Outside of the Battle Royale Dome, I guess there isn't really too much going on there. So I guess we might as well head to the next route and see if we can take on the next like trial. Although I kind of feel bad. I kind of skipped that last route a little bit, but oh well. What are you gonna do? When why are you standing like that? Look at that Z-ring glittering on your left wrist. Now that is an item to envy. Faux show. I can help the admirer. Anyone wearing it? I mean, you could just ask to get one, right? I mean, you know, they're at Toys R Us now, I think. And crud, this place is pretty fire looking. I'm actually going to put Yawashi out because pretty sure we're going to encounter some fire types here. Without a doubt. And yo, what up, dude? You're missing out if you don't ever see... Captain Kiawi's dancing up to the volcano. All right, I'm going, I'm going. Gosh, but hope we'll have time to like do this in this episode. Yet again, that really cool music, and well, I guess we're gonna see some Pokemon in this area. Wonder, what are we gonna encounter? Oh my gosh, Salandit. Now this is probably one of the cooler Pokemon in this generation. So I've said in previous episodes like how I love the glass cannon archetype from Pokemon and. This guy's got that going on entirely. From what I can gather, it's a fire poison type that specializes in poisoning Pokemon, even if they resist poison. So even if you're a steel type or a poison type, you can still get poisoned by this thing. And I think that's awesome. And why, why are you just farting in my face? That's... I thought you were trying to poison me, Salad. Uh... Alright then, I guess not. Down he goes. Interesting. And yes, now we're gonna be level 20! Heck yes. So, I think I already gave it the Water Realm Z, but now in battle... Oh crud, my speed stat's actually my highest. That's actually really not good, but... Honestly, it's the single player of Pokemon. It doesn't really matter, but now, I think when we get into the next battle, we're gonna do- we're gonna see, like, the school form. And that'll be really cool. Oh yeah, she's a trainer. Alright, I'm gonna assume you have some fire Pokemon, so this will be a good time to show this off, and... Oh my gosh, it's a trial goer! Show me your Pokemon. Let me see the sights. Alright, I mean, it's just a bunch of fish stacked together. And, oh my gosh, Sightseer Maria. I, I don't know why, but when characters have a, like, blush to them for whatever reason, I dig that. And oh, she actually doesn't have a water type at all. She has a Meowth, but now we're gonna see the form of Wishy Washy. Come on. Yes, schooling. Now, from what I can gather, if you drop below 1 4th HP, you're gonna go to the standard wishy-washy form. Which is obviously bad, and dang! I may not have a ton of HP at the moment, but I guess that's gonna change, but seriously. Check out that defense and attack stat. It is through the stinking roof, like... I think our highest attack stat at the moment is... Actually, yeah, Combustor. And Combustor doesn't even come close to this thing, like, god dang! Is wishy-washy... Like, fair? Like, I don't know, man. We'll try another brine. I kind of want to preserve the uh, PP on that, but the downside is we're not very fast at all. And if we do drop below 1 4th HP, oh my gosh. Is Wishy Washy, like, seriously this strong? I can hardly believe it, man. And oh my gosh, I'll oh, a trial goer. An authentic Alolan expo. Look at that face. You can, you can save your selfie for after the, the, the battle, lady, just saying, alright, so... That was kind of interesting. I'm a little bit curious, though, where the trial starts, and crud, I just want to show off more wishy-washy, you know, I thought you were a trainer. I'm the cutest of the Seismic Sisters, a trio of my siblings, who love, love, love volcanoes. This cave here leads to the top of the volcano. 
Just so you know. Alright, thanks for the info, Lady and Crud. I want that item. I don't know if the trial is going to start in here, though. If it does, I'll probably save... Oh, yeah, it's literally right through here. Crud. Well, I don't know if I'm ready yet, but... In the next episode, I guess we can start on this. And crud, what's over here? Oh man, there's so much I want to explore, but oh well. I guess we'll save it for the next episode of Pokemon Sun and Moon. Thank you all so much for watching. I know we didn't really do too much, but I didn't expect for the next trial to be this close. So I'll save it for the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, and see you in the next part where we take on our next trial. Oh my gosh, our trainers are even hot because we're on top of the volcano. <laughs> that is so stinking awesome, but yeah. See you guys in the next part. Bye.